Hello and welcome to a Canon 70D tip. Today, how to connect your Canon 70D to a MacBook or iMac running Yosemite. So we start by downloading the software off the Canon webpage. The link is in the description below. You're going to need two pieces of software. One is the solution disk, so the latest one that has everything. And the other thing is the update for the AS utility. After you've downloaded them, start with the solution disk. Uh, open it, click on the installer, and here, since I don't want a lot of software on my computer, I normally just install the ES utility. So I'm not using the rest of the Canon software. You can do that perfectly well. And use something else like uh, Lightroom, for example. Uh, when you finish doing that, install the ES utility updater. Do this before connecting the Canon 70D. And when it's installed, now let's go to the camera. So turn on the camera. Use the menu to navigate. So you will go to Wi-Fi, where you will enable it and then Wi-Fi function. Here, let's start by giving the camera a name. I call it the Canon 70D, so I always know what it is on my Wi-Fi network. It's also the name that will pop up, for example, on the iOS app when you pair. After that, uh, go to the computer symbol, it, find the network, so the Wi-Fi network, click on the one that's of your house, and enter the password. This is not my password, it's just a Wi-Fi network that I set up for this video. The screen immediately after, uh, use your router settings. So if you have automatic IP, press that one. If you have to put it manually, use manual settings. Afterwards, press OK to start pairing, and you'll see the computer screen on the left. Automatically, the EOS utility already pops up. Press pair on the computer, and then OK on the camera, and you'll see that the EOS utility on the computer is already ready to use. On the camera, you can give this connection a, a name, so iMac in this case and you can already use the ES utility. So if you press remote shooting on the computer, you'll see that now uh, a new panel will appear that has all the commands you can to take pictures from the computer uh, remotely to your camera. So I just took a picture and you can see that now it's downloading it to the computer. Hope you enjoyed. That's the end of this tutorial. Subscribe to the channel if you want more tips.